it would be a great day to take off somewhere sunny, but you'll want to study up on masking requirements as the federal government announces travelers returning to Canada from international destinations will have to mask for 14 days. This as a Florida judge strikes down the U.S. masking mandate on airplanes. That's um something new that we were not aware of and I don't think most people were. Paul tells me while it may come as a surprise that Canada is extending masking requirements for travelers while the U.S. is dropping theirs, nothing really changes for Canadians heading south. In Canada, you're going to have to wear a mask. That's awesome. that's it. So if you're going to Vegas, you still have to wear a mask. Um, so for us Canadians, that's that's pretty easy. Tuesday, the federal transportation minister responding to the U.S. dropping mask mandates on flights, saying Canada has no immediate plans to do the same. And masks um, are proven to provide additional layers of protection, and um, um, we will continue to follow the advice of, of our public health experts. I reached out to University of Alberta U.S. constitutional law professor Greg Anderson for his thoughts on the U.S. masking mandate being struck down for airplanes. He wasn't available for an on-camera interview, but told me it was telling that the Biden administration doesn't appear to be fighting it. In Edmonton, Darcy Ropchan, City News.